A very cheerful morning dear students. Today we will revise the vocabulary of chapter 1 and 2. So let's start. Our first question is match the words with their meanings. In this question few words, idioms or phrases will be given and you have to match them with their meanings. Let's see the first word. Excitement. What does excitement mean? Exhilaration. Second word is ease of. It's a phrasal verb. And what is the meaning of ease of? It means to reduce. Next word is opponent. So what is the synonym of opponent? It's rival. Next word is our idiom. Pay through the nose. It means to pay too much for something. And last word is performer. Performer, it's the synonym of thespian. So let's move to the second question. Our next question is, take the correct option. In this question, you have to take the correct option to complete the sentences. First sentence is, I need two boys with lots of dash to move this table. And the options given are, hunk, rival, brawn. So whenever we have to move or lift something which is very heavy, what do we need? We need strength and here brawn is the synonym of strength. So our correct option is brawn. I need two boys with lots of brawn to move this table. Next sentence is after graduation there was a feeling of dash amongst all the graduates. Options given are spish elation and furnish. Whenever something good happens with us, what kind of feeling do we have? Like here, the graduates had been graduated. How would they feel? Would there be a feeling of excitement? Yes. And here the synonym of excitement is elation. So our correct option is elation. Third sentence is, the second question in the exam was a dash. Options are, tough not to crack, pay through the nose, or look up to. So, what will be the correct option? It's tough not to crack. That means, the second question in the exam was difficult to solve. Let's move to the third question. Make sentences using following words, idioms or phrases. Children, we would really appreciate if you will frame the sentences on your own. If you have learned the meanings well, then it would not be a difficult task for all of you. So let's see the first word. Incorporate. Incorporate means include. Sentence will be, you should incorporate rich vocabulary to make the speech impressive. Next sentence, next word is, go through. What does go through means? Go through means to experience. So the sentence is, people went through lots of difficulties due to coronavirus outbreak. Third word is drop the ball. It's an idiom and the meaning of this idiom is to make a mistake. He dropped the ball by not submitting the form on time and now he can't participate in the competition. Parents are requested to follow the same pattern as given in the video while giving the practice of vocabulary. Thank you.